what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new and you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash mm. i was dying to drink some water i have like super bad heartburn okay i don't know what the heck it is i think i had like some drinks yesterday and it's still bothering me today but anyways i've been dying to get on camera and talk to you guys because i haven't been filming as often as i would like and i just it's just when you work and you have brand deals and sponsorships and things like that sometimes you have to approve the video whatever it is so it takes me longer to get a video up to you guys i have so many videos pre-filmed so make sure you guys are subscribed and turn on your post notifications so you get notified every single time i upload and um you don't miss anything because there's gonna be a lot of content coming and as you guys know Victoria's Secret is still, well, their semi-annual sale started and it's still going on. And I went and I want to give you guys my take on it, my opinions, my thoughts, because I think that is um, important, especially if you are considering shopping the sale or if you have shopped the sale and you just want to know like what I think. <laughs> so let's get into that. But before we start, let's get into today's sponsor of the video. So let me introduce you guys to the Et Rudy Silicone Facial Cleansing Brush. I love that this is in a two pack, so you're gonna get two, which means you can share it with a family member or a friend. This material is amazing and it's great for safety and hygiene. And they also have their Derma Roller Kit, which is so awesome because it is four in one, which is perfect because you get a lot for your money. Everything is pretty much included. You have a jade roller plus a Derma Roller, which includes three replaceable heads with different sizes. This is perfect for combined use. The first thing you're going to want to use is the derma roller and this actually creates tiny wounds in the skin which trigger it to produce more collagen. The derma roller is made of high quality stainless steel and the jade roller is actually made of natural jade and it's very easy to use especially for beginners at home. This product is the perfect gift especially for a loved one, your mom, your sister, your aunt, anyone really who you know loves their skincare and also you guys <laughs> this is something that I would love as a gift as well. The silicone facial cleansing brushes come in different color set combos which are pink and gray, gray and teal. You also have blue and yellow and oh my gosh you guys this is so cute. And there's also a blue and pink combo which is very pretty. It reminds me of cotton candy. And today is a pink day and I decided hey I'm going to use my pink silicone facial cleansing brush along with my pink jade roller and derma roller. You guys I'm in my waist trainer but I'm going to be cleansing my face first. So that's the first thing I'm going to do. I'm using my cleanser, CeraVe, and then I'm going to be using my pink facial cleansing brush. Since it's like a pink day for me and I'm going to be using my pink jade roller and derma roller, this is actually really good because it helps purify your pores and massage your skin. With using this, it's better than just using your hands. I feel like I don't get that really, really good clean just with my hands. This is perfect for me. So I'm going to just be putting this on. I like to wet my face a little bit first. Now that my face is wet, I'm going to go ahead and put, I only put like two pumps of this and just going to go ahead and start cleansing my skin. My face is cleaned off and washed. And now I'm ready to use my kit. I love this. When I tell you guys, I was like seriously so obsessed with this four in one kit. And let me tell you something look at this jade roller, you guys. Gorgeous. I'm gonna go ahead and use a serum on my face. This is just hyaluronic acid, just to bring some moisture into my skin before I use my jade roller. A little bit on my hand here to go ahead. And apply that on my skin. I'm actually going to use this first. you guys that this jade roller feels so good on my skin it's cold 
it just feels amazing oh my goodness and i've had a lot of puffiness underneath my eyes the past few days so using this is definitely good after using everything my skin just is left feeling so soft and rejuvenated and i just feel really good and that's exactly how i like to start my day with my skin feeling really nice and rejuvenated and fresh Thank you so much at Rudy for sponsoring today's video and let's get into the haul. You guys, first off, I didn't even mention I have a Bath and Body Works haul too so maybe I should do that first and then we'll get into Victoria's Secret because there's not much. One thing about it, I've been really loving Bath and Body Works candles. I won't say they have the best candles ever, I'm gonna be real with you, I've had some, there's these DW candles from, um, Marshalls or TJ Maxx or whatever it was and I heard somebody on TikTok say he had no throat but one thing about it is I'm gonna tell you right now when you're gonna buy something take what someone says you know into consideration but don't let it determine or dictate like how you live your life or what you're gonna buy because I will listen to so many different people give me so many different opinions and you know what at the end of the day it's up to me and what I like so I ended up buying the DW candles from them and I actually really love that candle it was actually so strong that I couldn't even keep it lit here in my room because it was about to kill me like it was that strong you guys so I like it and I'm gonna put a picture of it in this video so you guys can see it if you want to if you guys want to get it but a one okay so first off if you watch one of my last videos I got this linen sheets candle this is actually not from Bath and Body Works it's from Mercari I love Mercari so much um, I got this I had to get it I've been wanting it I don't know now I'm like okay let me pay attention to the candles because I hate when I can't get a candle and I've been loving like laundry type scents anything that smells like some washed clean sheets now so I did pick up linen sheets on Mercari I think I paid um I paid less than full price for sure like I, it was probably like $20 oh no it was probably like 18 on Mercari so I think I got a decent deal um I really like the candle so I got linen sheets if you want to know the notes it's fresh ocean air on on your on your pair violet petals warm vanilla which is nice so i got my linen sheets candle and i heard that it doesn't smell see i heard somebody tell me it doesn't smell that good when it's burning and they had to take it back so for me i don't know i don't want to burn it right now i just kind of wanted it in my collection and another candle that i got from mercari i'm reaching over to get it i got these on mercari super good deal too i think i got two for 20 so that was nice and this is the cookies and cream candle now i have one already that i was able to get at bath and body works i was literally searching for it during like last year time right y'all i wasn't even planning on using it like that and i came home one day and i saw my candle and it was lit and my mom was burning it i was like like, I was like no like so it's kind of burned now so I was kind of sad so I ended up finding them um not too bad they were on like sale for a semi-annual sale but like 75% off so that was good but I didn't I didn't find any so I have them I love this candle if you can get your hands on it it's so cool this actually got me into liking more like chocolatey scents um but it's really really nice and I love the packaging so that was what I got and I went to Atlanta not too long ago like and I hate when I, when I go to Atlanta I can't say I hate that like when I go I kind of get off track because my boyfriend lives there and when I'm with him I don't really like to film and do all this stuff so it throws me off but I was able to find these little candles I got five of them but I'm only going to show you three because the rest I think I gave them to my mom this is it right here the happy Easter candles um I got these on 75% off I like them they're so cute so I brought them home TSA of course stopped me because they were like what the heck is that but they were cool with it and I brought them home got these for 75% off candles and just quickly I'll show you the other ones okay so laundry day laundry day I'm not gonna lie if you want to know a comparison between laundry day and the linen sheets candle you guys look at these candles like I don't ever want them to leave my collection which one's better I don't want to say okay I'm lying laundry day is better <laughs> In my opinion, my humble opinion, Laundry Day is much stronger on cold. This is super light. Linen sheets is super light, but yeah, it's, it smells so good. They're both nice, but if you want that really nice, fresh out laundry detergent, Laundry Day scent, 
laundry day is a winner but both to have both is a blessing next one i got is the salted ocean air which is really nice again it's a very fresh scent it's like a fresh ocean mist type of candle got this one i also picked up this the vanilla birch this is new i think not the scent but the packaging is kind of new with their like fall line that came out so i got this this is beautiful obsessed with this gorgeous i can't wait to burn it and then lastly i picked up the new vanilla pumpkin marshmallow so i don't know like i like the packaging i think it's cute especially if you collect candles this packaging is very very nice you can see that right there beautiful tahitian vanilla pumpkin spice homemade marshmallow Ooh, that's good so that's the little haul from bath and body works just candles to be honest and um i will talk to you guys a little bit more about my body care collection in a video coming soon and what's happening with that so stay tuned so let's talk about victoria's secret i have this little bag these are just i got 75 percent off hand sanitizers the unscented ones from bath and body works i don't think it's that special but let's talk about victoria's secret semi-annual sale and what i got one how do i like the sale I wasn't impressed at all. I don't think the sale is that great. I'm sorry. I used to shop, you know, semi annual sale and I used to go ham. The semi annual sale for me used to be about almost like finding items that weren't always in the store. I used to find like weird shower gels and things that normally weren't in the store. It wasn't just, I would say, I just lost track of what I was saying. But anyways, <laughs> it wasn't, I felt like it wasn't just about overstock items, but I get it. Like that's the purpose of the sale, like to probably sell things that just, you know, overstock items that just need to get out. But it used to be a lot more fun. I used to be able to get a lot of things that were rare items that were, it just isn't like that now. It isn't like that now. And my bag is not that full and you know, whatever. The first thing I got is this bra got this lovely lovely beautiful bra this is when i buy my bras this is a perfect time to purchase your bras because they're cheap like this is i think 50 percent off so i got this for like 20 bucks or so very very nice it's cute i don't like bras with padding because i don't need it and it's and it gives too much of like a bulky look and i don't want that so this is it i got this 50 percent off now i did get a couple of things this is so cute for working out if you see this bra get it it's so 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 cute and it has support it does have padding in here however it doesn't come off like a padding to make you look like you have bigger boobs but more so just so that you know you have that extra support and also like you, nothing's poking out you know and it has a little bit of like that Victoria's Secret print on the back very cute again 50% off so I'm I'm literally ready to do some jumping jacks in this sports bra okay um the next thing I got is another bra and it's I think it's literally the pink version of this I don't know I just be picking up stuff you guys um yeah it's very cute again it's not gonna have any you know padding inside but I had to pick up some bras so I have three new bras for the summer and that's it but if you guys have shopped the sale feel free to leave me down in the comments like anything that you know you know your opinions on the sale because i just don't think it's all that i'm not gonna lie to you and mm, bath and body work sale it's still not the same but i think i don't know if it's because like i've been shopping at these places for so long and it's like i don't know if any of you guys ever used to watch 106 in park on bt was it on bt i'm too old now i don't even remember i think it was <laughs> and like there was something about it not being on tv anymore that was so devastating but before it stopped being on tv it started to get different like you could tell this wasn't hitting like it used to that's only if you know about the show 106 and park was the show and two ways body care wise a lot of you were telling me about peony crush okay it's peony i say peony not peony i used to say peony but it's peony okay peony crush a lot of you guys are telling me about it yes it came back and i'm happy i'm excited i'm grateful but there's a but there 
yo it's like victoria's secret knew not to do this okay they didn't bring back the fragrance mist like not even on their website is the fragrance mist available i already had purchased this from ebay and um i got it but i never can get the fragrance mist and something about mercari where i have it so that they can tell me which person uploads that fragrance mist but by the time i look it always says sold so sold, sold, sold. so i cannot get my hands on the fragrance mist for peony crush but they did bring this gem back. This is one of my all-time favorite body lotions from Victoria's Secret. If you can get your hands on this, please do. It's beautiful. It smells so good. And this was a semi-annual sale find I got back then when I wasn't even into Victoria's Secret like that. And I've been in love with this lotion ever since. And a lot of my Victoria's Secret collection is going up for sale on Mercari. So you can check that out. You can see my declutter video coming very soon. Um, it's just needs to be approved Ugh. i got bare vanilla shimmer in the fragrance mist why i don't know <laughs> i think i love bare vanilla anything vanilla from victoria's secret i pretty much always buy so um i got this and i've been liking shimmer lately so i've been spraying a little bit on so i got this these were still not cheap like let me be real 5.99 isn't that cheap i do believe it'll go down yes but um 5.99 still expensive i'm looking for three to two i used to get things for 2.99 bro mm, this smells so good i love bare vanilla from victoria's secret so of course i had to get it in the shimmer and also i got the body lotion in the shimmer as well you can see it up close and personal right here very very pretty packaging wrapped vanilla soft cashmere shimmer on the skin so bare vanilla I, i'll always pick up a bare vanilla although i could not find the fragrance mist for peony crush i did pick up the tropic splash fragrance mist from victoria's secret did i not get the lotion what's wrong with me oh my goodness oh my goodness i'm gonna be so mad i did not get the lotion for this this is giving me oh juicy citrus mango punch and neon burst hmm let me see I like it. This is cute. I like this one, but I need the lotion now. Dang, I don't even know if I want to go back to get the lotion. Um, I really just want Peony Crush, but this one is very pretty. It's very tropical, very nice. Oh, this is good. I like it. But next up, let me tell you about their perfume. So I used to get a lot of my perfumes from semi-annual sale, and I just don't like the selection of their fragrances. I don't know if I'm going to be purchasing from Victoria's Secret as often as I used to um, because I'm just not feeling it. Like, I'm not. Like, even though I notice, I don't even gravitate towards my Victoria's Secret lotions, you guys. I have not been using them. Um, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to just list them on Mercari and I'm giving them to my... My friend came over and I gave her a whole bunch of stuff because I was like, no, I'm not using this. And I'm not going to let it go bad. I'm going to let somebody else get it. Um, so, that's just what's been happening with my Victoria's Secret lotions this one though i will use her i will use her i this is like one of the first lotions i ever finished from victoria's secret but this right here oh this is so pretty and reflective this is rapture and out of all the perfumes that i smelled oh my goodness somebody gave me bombshell passion baby like i'm just kidding i am going to be purchasing that perfume one of the um essays told me that the bombshell passion from victoria's secret has to be oh no has to be one for like the perfume of the year for victoria's secret like out of all their fragrances bombshell passion it is gorgeous and it's only like 58 for the small that's what i believe she told me so that will be one of my purchases very very soon but i did pick up rapture i'm gonna open it right now to show you guys a little bit of an unboxing rapture i smelled it in atlanta when i was there and then I was like, eh, I'm going to wait till I get home to, to buy it. Because, you know, it was kind of, I, I, it wasn't big. Actually, it wasn't even that big. I could have brought it home because it's only 1.7 fluid ounce. Um, so this is supposed to be like a cologne. Beyond love, there is rapture. It has Bulgarian rose, amber, musk. Okay, Victoria's Secret. Let's open it. Here she is wow this is much smaller than i thought this is it right here i got the rapture perfume 
if you can see that. I am gonna spray this on again because sometimes I like things and it could change, but just let that settle. This, to me, is very mature. If you're talking about like a mature fragrance, this has got to be that. Now, I picked this up because I feel like this is something that you won't have to spray a lot of and it will last on you. My Victoria's Secret perfumes have gotten me compliments, so that's why I don't sleep on their perfumes. Now, the fragrance may sound, baby, if you just want to refresh, you know, you could probably use that. I, there's only like two fragrances from VS that I really think you need to like have if you want like long lasting, which is Bare Vanilla and Coconut Passion. But Rapture, oh, like this might knock you out. Like <laughs> this is like a knockout, punch you in the face fragrance. Like I just sprayed that one thing and I'm like, oh my gosh, like this is, I gotta wear this and see what the lasting power is like so I can come back and like give you guys a little bit of a review. But this, my friend, this one little spray will knock you out and um if you like that like a knockout fragrance get rapture because it's strong and not only did i get the rapture spray but i went ahead and got the rapture lotion you know so this is a fragrance lotion i was like you know what we're about to be bougie rapture definitely gives me bougie girl like you smell like money when you walk in the room it definitely gives me that and it's cute so i got the lotion we're gonna see if it's any good this will probably be my like scent of the day one day so i can see how it goes and if anyone compliments me or anything like that but i gotta do that soon so that you know you guys can get it before the sales up but i'm i'm, I'm with rapture i am if you want to get this get it um it's strong though you can't stand like a strong fragrance this probably won't be for you. I have to tell you guys my scent of the day though. I am wearing the Black Opium by so. Uh, this is so spicy to me. It's very gourmand, very pretty. Love it. Oh my gosh. Very, very nice. And this is like the limited edition packaging. I talked about this in my Rebel Sense video. I love Rebel so much. Like if you guys shop for perfumes, definitely check out Rebel. Um, And yeah, Black Opium. What are you guys wearing today? I completely am blown away by the amount of support I get here on my channel. Like, it's beyond me. Like, we just hit 38,000 subscribers. And, of course, like, I'm trying to get to 40K, 100K one day. Let's pray, Jesus. Um, but I have to appreciate what I have now and the people that are supporting me. And it's it's beyond amazing and i don't think this video is going to be too long because i mean that's it like i just feel like this victoria's secret sale wasn't all that and i just won't be shopping there as much because i just don't want to have a whole bunch of these you know fragrance mists and i am not in love with them or you know using them as often so i'm really focusing on keeping things that i really love however i'm still gonna buy stuff especially because i love talking to you guys about stuff that's out here in the stores it's, that's not gonna stop but i definitely don't want to like keep them too long because you know it's not do, it's not serving the purpose that i needed to serve and i did want to you know give a little bit like a little bit of a motivational talk here at the end of the video might as well why not if you're here this long leave team ash in the comments i just want to say i know that you guys really love like the videos where i'm like super motivational and like encouraging and the thing is i've always wanted to do that like i've always wanted my channel to be like a place where it can help other people you coming here and watching my videos helps me so i wh whatever way i can try to help you guys and motivate you and you know leave you with something i will you are doing your best i hope that you will never be too hard on yourself like i hope that you will give yourself the credit that you deserve even if you don't hear somebody giving you the credit give it to yourself i give myself the credit okay i know how hard working i am and i know how hard working you are and you don't need anyone to tell you that you've got to write down your small goals and honestly celebrate all the accomplishments even the little ones you getting up early you getting that workout in eating something healthy start making some things that aren't really you know habits habits start turning those bad habits into good habits it's easier said than done write down like three things that you want to do every day for 30 days 
and you just mark it off give yourself that check mark every single time you do it every day give yourself that pat on the back keep working at things that make you happy comparison is the thief of joy do not compare your life to others you don't know their story you don't know you don't know how they got there you don't know what they did to get there you don't know if they cry at night you don't know you do not know all you see is like the glamorous outside you see the finished product people always see the success right they always sit there and they're like oh my gosh like i wish i had that i wish i had the big house the cars the money but what they don't realize is there's some things you got to do to get all those things there's some times you just have to cry at night you don't feel good about yourself sometimes you just want to quit in reality we don't think about that and we don't think about how hard those moments are we just want the end result without looking at what the heck comes with it and i say all this to say be content with who you are don't be too comfortable but definitely be content and be grateful and find happiness for the little joys in life i found it crazy that you know just hearing from kim kardashian who is a huge celebrity like you know she's a businesswoman i gotta give that lady her credit that's what i will do very very smart lady one thing about her with kanye west you know they're getting a divorce and one thing that she said was that I just wanted him to spend more time with me you know i wanted to be able for, you know, i wanted for us to do the same things like you know he has different goals in mind like you know certain things like just working out together she wanted that and and they have everything but the one thing that was so important to her she didn't have and that was like that quality time with the the man who was her husband and that made her unhappy so you know people probably you know idolize their marriage and at times it's like um sweetie you don't know what really goes on behind closed doors you don't so just just remember that comparison is a thief of joy don't let anyone or anything steal your joy keep working hard be a boss okay you are a boss and claim today as your day you're gonna make something of yourself today you're gonna make today a good day whenever you see this i love you guys so very much and i hope that you guys are having fun shopping and if you're not shopping i hope you're having fun watching these hauls on youtube i love you i love you i love you and make sure you guys follow me on instagram uh turn on your post notifications over there and also i will put this on my community post and i will also put this on my instagram page wherever um send me pictures to my instagram at ash 220 underscore send me pictures of your collections um to be featured in a video so send me a picture of it um it can be a video too whatever send it to my instagram ash220 underscore i will feature it in an upcoming video i won't tell you guys what the video is about but it'll be cool so do that and make sure you follow me and um follow me on tiktok too at living ash 20 and the ash life my vlog channel so you guys can see the behind the scenes um i'm gonna be doing a nail update on there soon so that's it I love you guys so very, very much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.